Uh, it's, uh, have you ever seen a comedy called Best of the Worst? It's, it's quite old. It was on Channel 4 and it uh, had uh, David Mitchell as a guest captain. Uh, nope. Oh, it was really funny. There's a, it was a, it's basically like Best of the Worst. It's, it lists the top five worst, but it's like the best top five worst things and there's um top five album cut co- worst album covers and there's um there's this one where it's a guy literally um standing um um standing there um holding sort of like something erotically it's called I'd like to touch him <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's so funny <laughs> And there's another one where it's a, uh, um, um, and there's uh, another one that says, I'd like to tell you about, and um, Frankie Boyle's on that, and he just says, my cock and balls. But it's actually, I'd like to tell you about my operation. <laughs> and then, um, and then it's just like, would you like to guess where? Of course. <laughs> Take a wild guess. <laughs> of course it's just private. <laughs> Oh yay, I have, um, ten apples, which means my weapons last longer. Hooray! You have ten apples, therefore you are the guy. Oh my god! I'm actually doing really well. I don't, have I actually lost anything yet? <laughs> I'm not sure if I have. If I, if I go through the whole game without losing a mission, I'll be really amazed. It won't happen, because Hot Air Skyways is the hardest CTR challenge. Sky. Pretty much, but due to where one of the um, CDR tokens are, it's placed on the shortcut. Oh crap! I'm sp- oh right, yeah, shit. I've only just realised. Oh fuck! <laughs> I've just realised I'm going to lose this challenge. Why? I've only just realised this isn't a race; it's a CDR challenge. <laughs> I haven't been collecting them. I've only just noticed when I saw the T just then. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. <laughs> I've only just noticed that I was supposed to be doing a CTR challenge. But my mind went completely blank. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Brain freeze. That doesn't mean, okay, I've lost one. <laughs> just it's ironic, how I say. I wonder if I'll go through the entire game of not losing one. Yeah, of course. Yeah, and then now you do. Yeah. Of course, and it's on the final lap. <laughs> Most of you would think that's planned, but really it's not. I honestly didn't realise. <laughs> I really am that stupid. Yes, you are. Yeah. Yes, I am. Oh. Surprised I didn't see that. Especially that, considering it's blatantly out in the open. Okay, that one I can understand not seeing. I can understand not seeing that R. But the others I should have seen, at least within the corner of my eye. Why not just the middle part of your eye? Oh well. Oh, that was close. Do do ah! Oh shit. This isn't going What's well. Ah, oh, much better. I'm moving fast again. Do, do, do die, humans! Pathetic fools! Haha. No. <laughs> Insolent fools! Here's a little surprise! No. That's an outside quote for you. That's an outside quote for you. You're slower than a Pakistan slave! <laughs> I'm rather good at that. That's the one voice I'm really good at, as well as Yoda. Powerful I am. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think ever says that. No. The force you have. The force you have. Powerful I am. <laughs> Okay, he didn't really say that in that manic way, but I like to think that he did. Yeah. I like to go that extra mile and prove that he's a psychopath. <laughs> there was um, well, that technically he is a bit. Yeah. I mean, the the third one was um the the third one was very misleading. I mean, um, 
into hiding, I, I, I must go. What he should have said is, fucked we are. Because <laughs> there's no hope, really. I mean, I can buy the whole, oh, Luke Skywalker, blah, blah. No, actually, I can't. I'm sorry. There's no way in hell he would want that one guy, even if he is the son of the great Darth Vader. If you haven't seen Star Wars, I'm ruining it for you. But if you haven't seen Star Wars, you're really sad. Yeah, no, hardly. He's his father. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, I can buy it, but I can't. <laughs> in the same time because it's not wholly plausible after seeing Force Unleashed I can sort of buy it more because there's a new hero as such which I sort of like actually I don't think I should, I don't think we should really take those things into account do you think? no I don't know maybe just, just the main movies and that's it yeah Although the first one was yeah, horrible. All the other things are just excuses from Matt Lucas. To yeah. Be Pretty much. John Lucas. Yeah, Not Matt Lucas. <laughs> Comedy writer, writes Star Wars. George Lucas stole them somehow. He's actually from the future. He stole these ideas. Or like, um, you want to go, they want to get, they want to get in the village, I have. Only Jane. Uh, what, where's the place where he is? Only Jane no. think about I am. Can you do a uh, Welsh sounding Yoda? Um. Only Jane, no. <laughs> Only Jane in the village. No, not really. <laughs> in the wall. Only gay in the wall? Okay. <laughs> oh. I'm not very good at doing that. I'm not good at doing a Welsh accent. That's not Welsh, is it? <laughs> it's very easy to get from a Welsh accent to a more, more like, um, Pakistani. <laughs> yeah, probably. Indian. Oh, I got gold! I got a gold! I yeah, got I'll show you. Ha 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 ha! Now I'll show you. Look at his huge grin. I think his teeth take up the majority of his face. I think his teeth has been glued together, and he can't, and so is his lips, so he can't actually move them. He's trying to cl stop smiling, but he actually can't. It's just like, no! Maybe that's why he's so annoyed when he meets Crash. <laughs> My teeth! <laughs> How many times have we had to see that absolute whore? Um, a lot more because in the credits there's actually four of them. Oh dear. I know, it's horrible. <laughs> and, they all, and they're all doing that sort of effect where there's like loads of um, sort of clones and it sort of does the delay follow thing, you know, where it shows millions of them but slightly behind and stuff. Oh, yeah, like, um, um, like the swimming thing. Yeah, sort, sort of. of. Sort of, uh, what's it called? Synchronized swimming. Sort of, yeah. It's like that, but it's like it's it's like that sort of effect. Now I am doing a CTR challenge. <laughs> I am Can't doing. It sounds like um, an alarm from Goldeneye. Hmm. Like meow, meow, meow. I can't do the solid snake thing. So, <laughs> hide under a box. You've been spotted. Snake. 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 <laughs> Oh! Destination planet SR388. No affair. The fog out yet. The fog out yet. The fog out. What are you doing? Get the fog out. Out of time now. Out of time now. Seriously, seriously. Fucking get out. Fucking get out. GTFOG. 
<laughs> ah, I got eaten. Well, at least I've shown that off now. At least I've shown that off now. It's pretty cool. It totally is. What? It's that, that plant that just needs you as a vocal barber from Zelda. <laughs> What was that thing? Do you watch Chuck Conroy? You do, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, what was that thing he said in Wind Waker, that really horrible creature? The one was really quite scary. Oh, the Floormasters. Yes, those. They terrified me. Yes, they, they, they terrify everyone, I think. That, they looked really creepy. I did not like them. One of the sole reasons I won't be getting Wind Waker. Well, they're worse than the Jura's Mask in Ocarina of Time. Ah. Uh. Okay. I really want to get oh shit no no <laughs> I really want to get those games because I want to actually play one of them I, so, I, I started out being uh, Twilight Princess but I didn't like it because the wolf I, I hate the wolf I, I'm not going to lie I, I find it really boring it's like how some people find the werewolf boring in Sonic Unleashed however I found it enjoyable but nevertheless which is why this is my first game in this episode no the werewolf was fun I found it quite good but I just, I never liked the wolf. I, I found you it... Like, you don't like the collecting of the tears of life. No, I found that really boring. And I got stuck in the second town. The second time you have to do it, I got stuck. And I was like, where the fuck are these things? They aren't Did you anywhere. Did you house? No. <laughs> You're supposed to blow up a house. So I supposed to know that. You're supposed to blow up a house and then business says, well, if we have to get tears of light, sometimes you just have to blow up people's houses. Really? And the house remains blown up for the rest of the game. Interesting. Well, I borrowed the game and it's now returned to its rightful owner, so I can't actually continue it. Yet. <coughs> now, I will not be getting all the, um, things. The reason being is that they are annoying. Why do I say that? Well, there you see. Yes, then. Not only are they sort of off edges, but there's also um, one where you have to actually jump off a, a ledge. Technically, you get like eight points, but it's still really ridiculously boring. And that one's really irritating. Imagine someone doing this in one lap. No way. <laughs> Unless you backtracked. No way. Yeah, it's kind of impossible, actually. Or unless you use a TAS. TAS, well, I suppose, maybe. It's all assisted speedruns, I love them. I absolutely love tool assisted speedruns. It's my favourite speedrun ever. It's just so awesome how many glitches there actually are. I mean, seriously, I was watching, um, because uh, me and my friend Zia Lightning were doing, um, Super Demo World, which is a Mario hack. And we were, um, I, we were watching a TAS of the stuff we'd done. Some, uh, like, a world which took us an hour took him five minutes to do 100%. I'm not kidding. It was just like, how the fuck? I mean, seriously. There's just no way. With that sort of thing, you know, you just program into everything. You have to take it apart. Just, I love them, though. There are so many glitches you don't know about. It's brilliant. That's the good old, uh, Key jump trick. Yes. I'm not very good at that one. Yeah. Key jumping's quite hard actually. You'd be surprised. Can't be as hard as bomb jump. The um the one where you can um shell jump, that's pretty easy. I'm g I've gotten good at that. Like my, my first time attempting to shell jump was in a Kaizo hack. That was not smart. <laughs> Although I did do it, to be fair. It took me about ten minutes, but I did it. <laughs> oh, well, that is the end of this part. See you guys!